would you send a mime into a Pokemon battle to fight for you in the front lines? Mr. Mom, get up over here. We just uh, knock it out. So, here we go. Magic even should work against this. Although, what he should do is retreat. Alrighty then. So, we could use Life Trick GX, but we're going to do Breakdown. Here we go. Breakdown. So that, that way I can try to get two prize cards. Try to get another prize card somewhere. We might we might, we might get rid of it. Use oh yeah. Mr. Mime Deck. Here we troll. Alright. Hello, Negros. And the French Rolls. It's Donald. Welcome back to my kitchen. And on today's menu, I'll be serving you a Mr. Mime GX deck. No way, no way this is gonna work. Oh yeah, oh yeah. And you can see him going to battle, front lines, everything is there. So, how are we gonna do this? Well, here's the big picture. Mr. Mime, as well as Hoopa, is going to tank. They're both gonna use their abilities so that your opponent do zero damage. Now, they both don't do that much damage themselves because their abilities are powerful, so they're gonna help, or they're gonna have help with their damage due to Sigui GX. With his ability, oh yeah, you're gonna get two hits KO. He's like, not one hit, nope, two hits, two hits. But you can't die, so let's break it down a little bit more detail. Mr. My basic 150 HP. For GX, this is awful. Yeah, I mean, most minimum is like 170, but you do have this ability, Magic Evens. Basically, if your first number of the attack starts with the even number, then you do zero damage. Zero, zero, zero damage. And the thing is, most Pokemons have an even number attack. The thing is that Choice Man, Choice Man makes it odd. So you don't want Choice Man on your enemy's Pokemon. So this is what you do. Have Lysander's Lab. When Choice Man comes into play, it does not work. Or you can just remove the Choice Man. And that's the trick. And you'll just see how that works in a couple of matches. All right, so that's gonna keep it where magic even is gonna work. Now sometimes your opponent might have some way through it, but mm, what really is threatening to Mr. Mime GX? Probably another GX Pokemon. So we're gonna use Scoundrel Guard, Hoopa. Prevent all attacks and pretty much everything. Yeah, everything uh, from GX Pokemon. Yeah, you don't need Mr. Mime, but actually, it does help. We'll see. We'll see on that. Hoopa is the other card. Now, his damage is 80. This Mr. Mime is based on your opponent's hand. You add up all the cards in your opponent's hand. They're holding around maybe six, maybe more. But the damage is pretty low. So this is why we're going to use the Sigewatch GX. Yeah, we got four of these. They're going to sit in your bench and they do 20 extra damage. Wherever you like for every single one. One of them 20, two of them 40, 60. You get the idea. You can't get out four of them for 80 more damage. In that case, it's like, wow. All of them together just do as much damage as me. Ha! Ah, yeah! So now you have your shield. You have your sword. It's all ability-based. Everything sets up. We're good to go! So you're like, all right. Is he actually going to make this work? You bet I will. Yes, I like to go first. Let's see if we can get through my Mr. Mime deck. Odds. I'm sorry, this is evens. Evens. I think it is. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, we'll send the Hoopa first, and we'll send out Mr. Mime. We'll see who, who, uh, I kind of wish I had free retreat with this. Let's get started. All right, so welcome to the very first Mr. Mime troll match. I'm going to play my remix of Spider Dance from Undertales. All right, this deck. In this case, I know what's going on. He's actually weak to Evas. Let's go ahead and throw Mr. Mime on right here. All right. All right, Donald. Gotta watch the stream, but I got homework to do. Homework is very important, kids. Gotta, gotta do that, so. All right, thank you. Now, let's go ahead and start off. Our Pretty much our damage for this deck is gonna be coming from Rowlets. And let's go see if this is heads or not. It is heads. In that case, I would like more nest balls. Kinda want them to be rare candies, but this will get me more value. Okay, well, let's, and we're gonna go ahead and play Lily here, see what we can get, eight cards, eight fresh cards, Ooh, wow, very, very, oh, very, very nice, I may not actually want to play this, 
Here you go, Mr. Bob. You can have this. Do I? It's a... I think I am gonna actually gonna play it. So, this is a very nice starting out. Please do not end and shuffle my hand away. This is nice. Let me keep this. Let me keep this right here. Hello, Yoshmosh. Okay. Mr. Mime Wall today? Exactly. This thing happens to be weak to it, so... I'm cool. He's gotta go for the back line. Heavily go for the back line to hurt me here. I might actually need... You know, we'll make this deck better as we go along, but this is the very first iteration here, so... Let me get the water. Thirsty. Caffeine. I have too much caffeine and it's, it's making me crazy. Oh, Lily. Big, big opener. The Alga. Uh-oh. The Alga can get through my evens. That is gonna stink, stink, stink. Darn. Darn. Oh, but it can't get through my Hoopa. Yeah, it can. It can actually get through my Hoopa. So, we'll go ahead and rare candy our first. Wow, we actually have two Decidueyes. We can play. Yeah, I don't have to Ultra Ball for it. All right, if we can get these babies out. If we can get this last one evolved, I might be greedy because if I pull rare candy for the last one, that'd be good. But I can't pull rare candy for the last one. All right, I actually don't have any energies as well, so we're gonna do this right here. Not gonna put another Mr. Mime evens down. Instead, I'm gonna slow him down. Oh, I can't play Guzma right now. All right, we'll use Feather Arrows. That means we gotta get rid of the threat, so I gotta go ahead and put everything here. So, it just is so unfortunate that he has this card that has the piercing effect of this, the evens in there. All right, so I'm gonna leave it be right here. Enjoy some business, business oh, just a guy. Thank you, just a guy here. All right, so hopefully he does not have another one. And we can go, oh, just max motions that. We're gonna go and Guzma some of the tech out of wear. So, he had to lose an energy Apricorn Maker. Search for two balls, like two Ultra Balls, which will just, and Nest Ball. That actually is pretty good. That actually is pretty good. So let's see, these retreat are pretty darn bad, so. We may, yeah, we'll have to wall against this. Actually, we can two-shot this. We just need to pull the rainbow energy now. Yeah, yeah, we can fight against this. I just, oh man, there's only four rainbow energies in your deck. I don't have another draw on this last spot. Here's 200 more bits. It's from Adjusted Guy here. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much, Adjusted Guy here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. And take a look! It is Ultra Necrozma. What? Okay, so this... Let's see what we have. We have a Rainbow Energy! So this boy, Mr. Mime, can actually attack. And he can heal up himself with the Life Trick GX, too. Ah... Who should attack? I can actually get a prize card right now, as well. But this is a threat, so I'm gonna go ahead and try to get rid of it. Here we go, let's throw this down. And I'm gonna need Banana Master right now, so let's, this is gonna be our only Mr. Mime even. Actually, I wanna take away that Choice Man right now, too. I don't need Guzma. I don't need Mr. Mime even at the moment. If I really want more cards, I could get the Sigilite, but I'm stuck. I need the cards now. We're gonna go ahead and discard that Choice Man, because that does allow him to break through my evens. And I'm gonna go ahead and use Psychic, see if I can, you know, pull something, maybe evolve this. Hey, three Decidueyes, oh yeah. And he's got a big hand too, so we're gonna do Feather Arrow. We gotta get rid of the threat. And we're missing th our four Lysander's lab. So here we go. Peppering this with all our magic. We might be able to defeat it before it does anything tricky. So we're gonna do Breakdown here. And take another 60 damage, so we'll be able to Yeah, that thing's gone. My, four, my three Decidueyes like, yeah, you don't worry. We'll take care of it. You gotta put another max potion or something. So this here, Matang, they're all evens. They're all evens. He does have another max potion, so he's just buying time with this. All right. And this, yeah, we'll, we need Lysander's lab. So ASAP, I need to pull some more draw supporters here. Dog Dogs is a very electro, electro septile GX. That's not a bad idea. That's pretty cool. You can feed a sword.
I get inspired for Pokemon decks from you. Here are more bits. Thank you very much, oh Justin Guy. I'm glad I can help you out. Polv94 has subscribed. Thank you very, very much, Polv94. It helps out a lot. This is your first time, so thank you, thank you, thank you very much, dude. Okay, so back to the action. We are trying to take this guy out. But he keeps healing up, so we gotta keep on going for the threat. Actually, we might. He doesn't have any energy this time, so we could actually take some prize cards with this. Like, no, no. It's a threat. But you could actually do this too, so. We're gonna take a prize card before they grow up and become big. There we go. Take a free build him. Yeah, I forgot I had that. Okay, so you could have done that earlier. Now this only like, works in the active, so I think this should be it. We can always switch into the Hoopa too. So wall is kind of breaking and working up. What's working? Now I can full finish this off in the next turn too. So this is probably the most efficient way to do it. Take a prize card, do this. I probably in the previously. Uh, we'll look we'll back. We'll, we'll focus back on here. There's 30 more bits. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Adjusted Guy. All right, so. Rare candy, the, finally the first Metagross is up this year. Oh, man. We actually should leave the Choice Man on because it hits, it hits for an odd number. So this is something that gets through it, but it cannot get through the Hoopa. Ah! Oh! Okay. Maybe we should just prepare that ahead of time. Yeah. You got a you got an evens wall. You also have this too. So Tate Liza. You know, I thought it was the baby one. Nope. This is just this is the the GX version. In that case, leave the choice man in there. Lysander's lab is canceling, you know, choice man, so that's not so good right now. And he's got both of them evolved, so we will see. We will see what's up. We need another Rainbow Energy, too. If he hits me, he takes two prize cards, so I don't want him to do that. And here's 230 more bits, says, Oh, just a guy. Thank you, thank you very much, Oh, just a guy. Okay. Thank you, man. That's all. Thank you, thank you. Charging up the Alga. I may have to give up this Mr. Prime, guys. Because I can attack right now and finish him off. And I that, think that's what I'm just have to, to do here. He's holding yet another six cards. So, in that case, Mr. Prime, it will not get through the Metagross GX. If he's holding an energy, it will finish him off. So, I'm going to trade. Actually, I don't have to trade. I don't have to lose anything. I don't have to lose anything. I could just do a switch right here. I'm just not going to get the KO this turn. But I lose nothing. Because next turn, I these two Sejuani can take him out. Yeah! So, we go. If one wall doesn't work, you use the other wall. Although this wall should work a lot. So, uh, let's hear. Okay, so. All right. All right. Thank you. Thank you, Adjusted Guy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. He's still charging up the Alka, yet I can still go for the back line through what these deciduous. Maybe he doesn't think about that. And of course, you can't hurt Metagross with this. Actually, this is probably the best wall now. Now that I see is completely all GX. He evolved all his Pokemon. He could have kept one of these unevolved, but like, nope. Now you gotta get through the hoop by the wall. It's like, well, I'm the real wall here. Who needs magic evens? He's gonna use his GX now. But we're going to take out that with the Decidueye. And until I get another Rainbow Energy, I could always switch in too. I don't want to switch in because, hey, this is an odd number, man. This is an odd number. It's one of those rare Pokemon that actually hits for an odd number. All right, he popped his GX attack. So what am I going to do? All righty then. So I really can't do anything, unfortunately. We're going to go ahead and see if our prize cards actually has a Rainbow Energy in it. Poke, poke, and one more poke. There we go. Those energies have been wasted. Two prize cards. More another decision on Pal Pad. We actually need some. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I do need Acerola and Hoopa. Uh, let's do a little bit of both. 
and I think that is it. All right, we've got both of us got plenty of cards left, and then we'll just uh, hold on here. Hello, Logan Flakes. Welcome. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Let's see. What does he have? He cannot throw another base basic belt in them because I immediately do get a prize card off that. He's gonna Guzma. Bring up the Decidueye. All right. So you must have a psychic energy to go for a one shot Beast Ring. Ah, oh, that is a way to go get around it, unfortunately. Oh, I don't have a reshuffle. In that case, it may have should have got Ilima. He might have like all the Hoopas here. And then, oh, I mean all the all the Guzmas in his hand. So that might have two more and just bypass through everything here. All right, that's a bunch of that's he needs one more psychic energy. I think yeah, he could get them all them all at once. Photon Geyser, we are still alive. We are still kicking. So let's see, this hits for an even number as well. And it's immune to GX Pokemons. And he's holding a lot of cards. But he can easily switch into these guys. Easily, easily just take two prize cards. So I'm gonna go for the Hoopa. Actually, I can't go for Hoopa. I can I got KO. I might be able to let's see. Well, how much damage do I do here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I do 90, 90 damage. Plus 60 more. It's not enough to take a KO. So in that case. We're gonna be aggressive. We're gonna switch into with this and attack. We're gonna get Banana Master up too. I'm gonna set everything uh, onto this. Try to take it out because I can only hurt the front one. And if he doesn't heal this or have a max potion or something, that we'd be able to just uh, knock it out. So, here we go. Magic even should work against this. Although, what he should do is retreat. Alrighty then. So, we could use Life Trick GX, but we're gonna do Breakdown. Here we go. Breakdown. So th that way I can try to get two prize cards. Try to get another prize card somewhere. We might we might, we might, get rid of it. Use Ilma. Yeah, I wish I had Ilma, but that's my only Ilma and my only pal that was just used earlier. Right now, I'm just bricked right now. So, yeah. But, uh, we need, some, we need uh, some of the different uh, draws here. So, let's see what we got. Right now, our Decidueyes can knock this out in the next turn. He's got to heal it. And then we have to start trying to work for our last prize cards afterwards. So, let's see, man. He may know. If he's got a choice man, it's not going to work. Choice man, right now the evens is blocking him. So he's going to go for the back line again. Okay. And go for a fresh one. He didn't even have to attack with this. He could attack with this, too. But he's like, okay. That means mm, he's going to take his first two prize cards. I only do 40 damage now. Uh, Mr. Rhyme can attack, too. Oh, oh, oh! We're gonna lose our Decidueye. That's why we was like, we can snipe this off, but we can't. We actually can't snipe this off. If I attack now, I might be able to do that. So I'm gonna send this wall in because it's it's wield wall against everything too. All right. Loister has used 200 bits. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Loister. Hooray, Rayson. Welcome. All right, I don't know if I can take this last Decidueye out in time. I'm sorry, I'll build him in time. He took it out so he could throw another Beldum. He might be holding rare candy. So this is why we're going to go for Ultra the Cross. Let's see if we can get our draw supporter into our hand by knocking this out here. There we go. See if we get another rainbow energy, another draw. We only have one rainbow energy so far, so okay, that's okay. Okay, okay, okay. What do we got here? I'm gonna need a rare candy. I don't need Lysander's lab. I'm gonna try to get another Decidueye down right now, too. There we go. We get the rare, uh, we get the rare candy in my hand, so all I have to do is just wait here. All I can do is just wait. He's got all GX Pokemon, should not be able to get through this. I need one more prize card! If I got a Guzma, I might be able to pull that out. That'd be good. Guzma is in my deck. We've been bricked for a while. That's the only thing. We just been bricked, man. Logan Flakes, thank you for the cheer. Thank you for the bits. Okay. 
Ultra Ball. That might be rare candy into another Metagross. Yeah, I mean, you're throwing rare candies away. I know what you're pulling there. Okay, never mind. I don't know what you're pulling there. <laughs> you took a Matang. Because Matang can actually get through a Hoopa. Oh, okay, okay. It can't get through evens, Mr. Mind, but it can get through a Hoopa. So we can charge it up, do uh, go for a two shot, but if I take two prize cards, you know, in the future, you may have to end up evolving it, doing something here. Okay. He's still holding a lot of cards in his hand. I mean, a Guzma would be victory next turn. Uh, check, uh, take a look right now. All my Cynthia's are in my deck. Two, at least two Guzmas in my deck too, so they're, they're coming. We have 60 damage worth. He may just be forced to evolve this, which uh, will be a little lame. Hey, I may pull Rainbow Energy. The point is we're just stuck right now. And we're just going to wait. Mesprit God is now hosting. Thank you, Mesprit Gods. I had a rare candy stop you from getting bananas. I totally, totally, totally hate that too. Hmm. Tate and Liza. Is this going to be for a Switch or five more cards? Maybe he's stuck. He's going to be for a Switch. And he's going to start attacking me. Or maybe Ram. So if I take this out, I, 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 oh, I, well, I win then because I can eat Switch into Mr. Mime and take this out for my last prize card. All right, so he's trying to get rid of the Hoopa, but I got him. I got him. The Mr. Mime wall has succeeded. All right, so all I think I got to do is just do this. And let's see. This should be, should have 50 damage left, and he's holding on to five cards. That is correct. My math is correct. So all we do, we don't even have to evolve the last decision. Mr. Mime, break it down. Ah, uh, knock it out. Look, look, I can win. I did it. I'm Mr. Mime, and I can wall. Ain't that great? Good for you, Mr. Mime. Okay, that's all we want. Show's over. Show's over. And here we go, heads or tails? Tails! Okay, I'll go second. So fine, fine. It's easy better to go first for this deck because you can get your Sidious up. It's pretty safe because you're going to start with a Hoopa or Mr. Mime even. So I think we might be okay. However, that first turn could be pretty strong. Here we go. So let's go ahead and throw this on here. I'm going to play my remix of Burn from Tales of Bazaria. So cross here is is like, oh, I know that one. Uh, let's see. All right, so we got Lily. We got our draw supporters. We got Guzmas a little bit early here on our hands, so we may just end up destroying it. Now, this is... If this is Ultra Necrozma, he might be weak to Evens. He might also be weak to Hoopa, too, so leaving it here. Thank you, Willow. So, wait, is Cross here? I think he's busy right now. So, taking a look. Are these weak? Look, this is weak to Evens. This is weak to evens as well, so we're going to need our stadium. And we're going to want to remove every choice band that possible that we see here. Alrighty then, so I don't actually want to start off with my Rowlet. I'm going to try to get it to run away soon. I wonder if I should show up my evens or my Hoopa first. So we're going to start off with the Hoopa because he's, you know, the Hoopa is pretty safe. Let's go ahead and throw away the Guzmas. We'll get them back, but there's just the worst cards in my hand right now. And we're going to go, actually, you know, that could come down any time. We're going to go for more uh, roulettes, because you don't know that first one's going to live. I mean, that's just how it is, guys. So, pull the rainbow energy on. And we're going to go Lily, because that is the most safest opener. There we go, Lysander's Lab. So now he can't retreat. Let's see, I can rare candy for, uh, I could, I'm going to save this hand. I'm going to save this Ultra Ball. I could throw down another roulette, but that's a little too much right now. Yeah, I'm a little worried I might need the Ultra Ball. Maybe for something else here. So, with Lysander's Lab up, you cannot use your Float Stone. And a Choice Man would help with Mr. Mime even. So now he may start charging up an Enke or something. Okay, so... The bad part is here, I'm, I'm gonna need these Guzma soon. So hopefully we get something up here. He's still loading up this Ultra Necrozma. I mean, you can still go for the back line and get for these Decidueyes. That kind of sinks here. Malamar. Da, 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 da. I love the opening of Tales of Bazaria. Get a Guzma right away. Go for the roulette. Because he can't switch. All right. So this will take one easy prize card. And this 
sends in Hoopa right away, so he's gonna have to charge up Malamar or something to fight. Which then will show how we have actually Mr. Mime evens, which he cannot touch. Alright. Oh, yeah, it goes for uh, this here. Oh, well, in that case, we might just throw it in here another Photon Geyser. Luckily, we already have a Decidueye down. And that's all we gotta do. Alright, it looks like with this hand that he played, he's pretty stuck here. Alright, so. Here we go. We're gonna go ahead and rare candy. Uh, oh, oh, Hoopa. Hoopa can evolve. <laughs> gotta get Decidueye up here. Alrighty then. So. I, I, I kinda wanna ill him up, but I know he's stuck, so. I kinda don't wanna ill him up, because I know he's stuck. He's stuck. We'll wait. We will wait. I will start on another Decidueye though. Actually, I could Banana Master too. I, I could be Banana Master. Banana Master, you're always worth a spot. Then we might pull me something more that I can use, or maybe another draw support other than Ilima. All right. Well, that's you know that's all we got. So that's all we gotta do. Here we go. Um, let's see. 80 damage. I need this to two shot this Ultra Necrozma. So I'm gonna do this right here. We do want the two prize cards, so let's go ahead and do that. So next turn, if he doesn't retreat it, and then we'll just take it out then. Illima the best. Yeah. We don't need him right now. We need him another turn. And oh, we should have just played this and try to get the flow going. Flow. That's the that's the that's the deal deal here. Keep him stuck, don't Illima, that's right, that's right, full pie. He does not know about Mr. Mime Evens, but he does know that he has to get through the Hoopa, so... Invasion, he jumps in, but he can't retreat back yet, unless he does something with this. Floats still, and he's like, nope, Lysander's lap. I'm kind of mad I threw one away, but I need to Ultra Ball that, uh, my stuff down, so... My Banana Master. Alright, so hiding down the back there, Ah, oh, it's a shame, you can't get through my Hoopa still. We may not want even to set up any Decidueyes, too. Still loading this up. All right, so let's uh, let's start doing stuff here. Let's throw the order pad down. Try to get nest ball. There we go. I think that's what we need. Yep, nest ball. Here we go, nest ball. What are we gonna pull here? We're gonna go ahead. Actually, we need pal pad too. We're gonna go for Rowlets, that's, that's more damage for me, too. Now, the try of Ilma. Who gets this? Yeah, Hoopa, number two. Let's keep using you, and before I do this, one more card. Two removal. You know, those these things could kick in one day, so I'm gonna go ahead and remove it right now. And let's go ahead and use the trial of Ilma. Ilma, do you like Donald? I'm smiling. No! Okay, worst case scenario for all of us. I might hold on to this. I mean, it's a, it's, a, it's anything. It can be anything. So we're gonna go for feather arrows. I guess we'll go for this. We want to pressure him everywhere. Huh! Weakness. Oh, weakness damage. I forgot about. Oh, okay. Oh, two prize cards. Yeah, I guess he didn't see that too, because he would probably would not put it out up front. So, Hoopa is wallin. The Mr. Mime Evens will wall too. He's just not here yet. He's just not here yet. And he may decide to put Malnar, and then he knows he's really, really in trouble. Now, the Choice Man is what we're afraid of. The Choice Man does allow him to get through. As long as Lysander's lab up, he may be a weird here. All right, so this is, he sends NK. Good. Well, the AK is the only thing that seems to be able to fight. That's why you have Banana Master. He's just an easy card that lets you get through with the Hoopa right now. So, our wall is working, guys. Yeah, the last spot, it probably... Oh, we're going to finish charging up the Hoopa. This thing is loaded. It's like, just let me Guzma that out right now. So here we go. This is probably going to be uh, Guzma here. It's like, this is the only way to get prize card. Take out those Decidueyes. There we go. In that case, we'll just nail him. We'll nail him in the next turn. We'll be two prize cards into the game then. And Mr. Mime Evans could just show up and they're like, Hey, man, now you got nothing against me. Alrighty then. So taking the two prize cards, and I'll be ahead after this. Alright, so I'm going to be quiet. There's not much for me to commentate to say here. The weakness is a good surprise. Yes, it is. Alrighty then. Hoopa, let's go. Two Hoopas are now loaded up. We could ace the roll up, but that's not what I need right now. Let's go ahead and do this. 
It's nothing. Do I want to switch? No. Do I want to field blower? Not my own Pokemon stuff. So we're just gonna play straight Lily for three more cards. Turns out they actually three good two things I need. Here we go. In that case, I don't need the DCE. Yeah, I kind of do need DCE. We're gonna get another Decidueye up right now. Here we go. How lucky is that? Rare candy. You have tons of order pads. It's not luck. It's 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 predicting. Here we go. I don't wanna switch. I could switch to thin my hand. Get two more cards instead of one. How many switches I have left? I think I can work with this. So we're gonna go ahead and switch here. It's like why? Two more cards. It's gonna be a Mr. Mime Evens. And let's see, I do 80 damage. I'm gonna need 90, so we're gonna go ahead. Thankfully, our Decidueye is here. And Hoopa is like, you know, we got this, bros. Ugh. How we should know. He's got nothing to get through the Mr. Mime Evens. Even though Mr. Mime Evens isn't charged up, it's just late to the game today. These, both of these, like, they showed up to the party first, so that's how it is right there. Yep, you need one extra damage to kill. There it is. All right, AK is like, this is how I get through it. We must go into battle. And I was like, well, you don't know about this, us. Until you... <laughs> this will be up really, 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 really soon. There's no Banana Master. He's still loading us up. You know what? I'm just going to go for Guzmas for all my wins. That's a, that's good, too. We now can have weakness damage, too. So we can Guzma. Do 116. Just one shot this. So we got this. Our wall. I was like, Donald, I wanted to do something here. Show up earlier. You got to be there to get hired, man. I wouldn't. I was like, Donald, you can summon me or something. I think this is it. Well, I'm off to the day's plans. Later, Donald. Bye, zombie lover. I'll see you next time. I think this is it, guys. I think this is it. Yeah. Can you get through Mr. Mime Evans? Nope. Can you get through Mr. Mime Evans? Nope. Can you get through Mr. Mime Evans? Nope. Nope, 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 nope. We're Choice Man? Yes, we can. But this is blocking Choice Man right now. And this is trying to take away the Choice Man out of the, uh, the equation right there. So that is that. And it's like... <laughs> okay. I'm feeling guilty. The guilty part is... It's supposed to be your deck. You already have a, your first your first match was already really good, so we're just gonna wait. I mean, we have the winning move already. We're just waiting now. It's game. There's nothing you can do. And he's waiting to get through, uh, get to a decision. But by that time, it is gonna be over. Dun, dun. Alrighty then, so Mr. Mime Evans is getting charged up. They're all gonna be here. We actually should not do that. We should just try to finish the game off immediately. So that the, <laughs> that is that's a little bit bad mannered. Throw this on here. And we're gonna go ahead and use Super Cyborg, take weakness damage, and take our last two prize cards. So our troll deck has succeeded yet again. That's all we need for today, folks. So Alright, Mr. Mime Evans, you were totally gonna be a winner, but. I mean, we didn't have to. We didn't have to use you at all. Aborts his dog. Oh. Well, Mr. Mario was like, I'm sorry I couldn't entertain you. Okay. Well, looks like you made it to the end. Thank you, Integrals Differentials. It's time we rate this deck. Let's break it down. Mr. Mime GX, what do we like about you? We love your ability. We love that it makes you immune to damage against a lot of different Pokemon. We're gonna give that 4.5 out of 5 because it will affect your opponent, change the way they play. Just like, oh my gosh, I gotta find an odd number of Pokemon or do something about that. No, this is brand new. Nobody knows what's up with this. So that's why, yeah, yeah. Or maybe it may not become popular. Maybe not be, you know. Right now, right now as you're watching this, nobody knows what's up with this. So, we're gonna give a little bit extra there. It's gonna throw people off, and that's why. You have a better score than an average four. Moving on, damage is a three out of five. Can you achieve a two shot? With help? Yes. Can you achieve a one shot? No. So that's why you can have a three, not a four, not a 3.5. There's no one shot anywhere in this. A uh, defense, 4.5. Why? Because if you have immunity abilities, it's going to be hard for your opponent to get through. The game is going to drag on. Because you have low damage, they have no damage, so... Hmm. Okay, reliability. We're going to be safe. I'm going to give it a 3.5. I'm going to take a little bit of the score away because... 
you know, magic events, these abilities. It, the Your opponent just might have the right Pokemon, the right numbers to pierce through everything and be, uh, be able to get around this. Yeah, so I don't quite trust it. I mean, once people get what's going on, it's like, oh, yeah. Let me build my deck this way, this way, this way, and boom. They're, they're in trouble. All right, this final rating is a troll out of five. We're here to troll, and troll we did. We trolled the Mr. Mime Evens. We attacked, and we won. And that's how it works. So, that is it for Mr. Mime. You had your spotlight, and, you know, you could, you could take a nice break now. All right, I think we have one GX left that I have to do. Actually, two GX. Let's see, what day is today? All right. We're going to do Articuno next, then. Articuno GX. Now, this here... It's a tech car. You're not really supposed to fight with this. Uh, at least has minimal hit points, damage. Uh, we'll talk about that later. We're going to fight with it. We're going to do things that we're not supposed to do in Pokemon, so Articuno GX deck, it's an actual Articuno GX deck, not just a tech. So, that's coming up for next time. So, closing remarks, please like, subscribe, because I got more good stuff coming for you. But of course, it helps out. Twitch, if you follow me on Twitch, you'll be able to catch these streams live. If you support me on Patreon, it helps out with YouTube, Twitch, everything helps out immensely. So thank you very much for that. Discord link right in the description. Covers are on iTunes, Spotify, wherever you like to stream your music. We had some new ones recently, and new ones are coming. Yeah. Easy way to say it. So, that is it. That is it. Okay, no. So, thank you, Honor Girls. Thank you, The Parentals. Take it easy, stay safe, and I'm going to see you guys next time. Thank you. Bye-bye.